Miss Green, my name's Stephanie Guy. I'm your nurse today. The doctor's written some orders for you. Before we get started, will you state your name and date of birth, please? Very good. He's ordered that we get a sterile urine specimen from the catheter we just inserted. So um, I'm going to go in and get started with that procedure. Before I get started, you have any questions? All right. Let me uncover this catheter. I'm going to take the catheter and I'm going to pinch the tube and this little appliance I'll place around the tube so it'll hold it crimped. That way you're in a pool in this area for us. While that's pooling, I'm going to go on and gather my supplies. For this procedure, I'll need a pair of gloves. I'll need a 10 to 20 cc syringe. I like to use an 18 gauge needle on it. I'll need a specimen cup, the label for the cup, and an alcohol wipe. All right, Miss Green, it looks like we've collected a little bit of urine there. I'm going to open my container. When you open the container, keep your hands from passing over the lid or over the container so that you don't get microorganisms in them. Open the, open the alcohol wipe and the syringe. Clean the little port with an alcohol wipe. Insert the syringe. Take care that your fingers aren't right below this port so that you don't penetrate your skin. And pull out the urine. After obtaining a sufficient amount of urine for the specimen, be sure to unclamp the bag and put it back within the leg strap. Don't allow your specimen to touch anything. Take the specimen cup, tip it to its side, and inject the urine into the cup. Do not allow the needle or syringe to touch the cup. Do not pass anything over the top of the cup. Press slowly so that it does not splatter. Discard the syringe and recap. Pick your cap up from the side, taking care not to pass anything over it. Secure the lid, fill out the label and attach it to the bottle. Place this in a small, clear biohazard transport bag and transport the specimen to the lab.